Gemini, these are your May 2023 predictions. Let's jump right in. Let's see which goddess is guiding you this month. It's May with cycles and rhythms, okay? So this month for you is a month to honor the cycles and rhythms uh, of your growth, personal, spiritual, of your body. I'm also saying that having a routine of some kind uh, would be good for you, beneficial for your health. So like eating healthy at set hours, okay? Sleeping enough, okay? Honoring your body, sleeping cycle, and honoring that maybe this month is a month for you to stop and reflect especially the first half because the first half of the month till the 15th we have mercury retrograde if you haven't seen my mercury retrograde video it would really be beneficial for you to see it to get to know those energies because you really can use them when you relax and when you honor the cycles and rhythms of your body of your emotions, of your soul, and of the astrology. You can align with energies, you can uh, get more benefits from it. You can use it to your advantage. So the link to this video will be at the end of this reading, so stay with me. Okay, let's see what more do we have. Your angel is... Oh, you got the elokims. Wow. This month is important for you, Gemini. You have elokims, Arcturus, and Diana. Okay? And they are the powerful ones of the purple ray and the golden ray of transformation. See? Beautifully aligned colors on those cards. Honor that this cycle, this month, is a month of transformation for you. You're getting to know yourself. You're heightening your vibration. You're taking care of the cycles and the rhythms of your life. You're accepting them. You are honoring them. And you are using those energies into your advantage. It's time to stop, okay? Really, watch this video on Mercury Retrograde. I will link it at the end. It's very important for you. Because now you're transforming. And that's why you got the Elohims with you. Because this transformation is crucial for you. Wow, my ears are ringing. Really, it is, Gemini. And because of that, you have two spirit guides. I intended for two. But three cards just jumped right out. I guess this month will be very energetic. Like the spirit guides want to talk. They really want to talk. Um, actually, yeah, you have two spirit guides and one clue on... Um, yeah, let me get to that. <laughs> so, you have the shield maiden. You have the air guardian. Wow, beautiful. You are an air sign. The air guardian is with you. So really, you are showing up in a really strong position, Gemini, okay? Just honor your silks, cycles and rhythms, okay? And let the transformation happen because this is a time for transformation. And this transformation is getting you ready for something. Let me get to that a bit later. But first, Air Guardian, shift your perception, okay? In this... Uh, this transformation of yours is through shifting a perception, shifting your mindset, okay, to a more positive one and to honor the cycles and rhythms. Wow, listen guys, so positive affirmations would be perfect for you for this month because it's honoring the cycles and rhythms because our brain is the most receptive when we go to sleep or when we wake up. So during that time, it is highly beneficial to do positive affirmations. So... I have such video with positive affirmations that you can listen to, you can repeat them uh, before going to sleep or right after you wake up. It can be your short meditation in the evening, in the morning. I really recommend it. I will link it at the end of this video because you need to shift your perception, Gemini. It's really crucial for you. Think outside the box. Think positively. Raise your vibration, okay? And you need to... Wow, make plans and focus. You really need to watch the Mercury Retrograde video because I, I, I said it there. You need to stop, make plans and focus because you are getting ready. See, this maiden is almost ready for battle. She's just strategizing, okay? And you need to strategize 
and you need to shift your perception in order to do that because all of this, all of this transformation, huge transformation, you are getting ready for summer. See, you have the summer spirit, bask in joy and light. See, that's why you need to repeat positive affirmations or do something else that will help you bask in joy and light, Gemini. Because when you do in summer, you are manifesting something beautiful into your life. Wow. Let's see what the Akashic Records say. We have nutrition. We have anger, past life, and a soul friend. Yeah. I'm sorry that I'm saying it so many times that you need to watch the Mercury Retrograde video. But they are like your, um, your reading is so connected to this Mercury Retrograde vibes, right? Stopping and making plans, focusing, um, releasing what no longer serves you, which I can see here. Uh, releasing your past also. Wow. So this month, really be careful of what you eat because you need to eat healthy. We're going back to cycles and rhythms, right? Eat at the... Didn't I say that? Like eat at the set hours, eat good, sleep well, right? Good food will help you change your perspective to a positive one. That's what this card says. See? Shift your perception. Wow. Even more help. Positive affirmations. Good food. And the transformation you're going through is uh, through releasing anger this month. Something may anger you, but it is a test. Okay? It is a test. The universe wants to know if you have let go of the past because we have past life card here. It can be something from your past life, literally, if you resonate with that. But it can be something from your past from this life, okay? Something that angered you. It can appear in a new form. Mercury retrograde, really. And the universe will test you. Will you give in to anger again? And lower your vibration and slow your transformation down because you will need to repeat the life lesson. Or will you release it, okay? And will you be your truest friend? This card is like a... It, it's called a soul's friend, but it says be the best partner and friend for your soul, okay? So... See, this month you have a choice and this is your test through this. This transformation is going through this test, okay? So, will you choose anger this month, Gemini? Or will you choose to be your own friend and let go of anger and transform into higher vibrations and reach your goals faster? Because you can reach them in the summer if you shift your per perception, okay? You can make your dreams come true if you shift your perception now, Gemini, okay? You can do that. You really can. Wow. Woo. What energies, Gemini? If this resonates with you, please hit the like button, subscribe, share this with someone, comment it. I want to know what you think. If you want to win a free reading with me, uh, the instructions are in the description. If you want to order a reading from me, uh, the email is in the description as well. Just email me. But yes, Gemini, you need to shift your perception. It's really important. And you need to get to know uh, the energies of Mercury retrograde because they affect you greatly. So if you want to do that, the videos are popping on the screen. Please watch them if it resonates with you. Thank you for watching. I'm sending you lots of love light and everything good.